as a church, we thank God for the life of Prophet T.B. Joshua. He was a man rejected by all, but directed by God. I saw a church in Kambara celebrate. And, and the pastor came and said, T.B. Joshua, Neafu Day. And the church was celebrating. I said, if God did not even kill the devil up to now, he is not even celebrating that the devil is the devil. How come a man stands on the altar of the Almighty God to celebrate a departure of a great revelation? I reserved my comments. Directed by many, but directed by God. I have come to learn that sometimes when you are directed by God, you'll be rejected by many. But when you are directed and you submit to the standards of men, you are loved by many. Many of the men of God I respect in Nigeria are not commenting anything about T.B. Joshua. As if he never existed in their life. But I might not be so significant worldwide. But because I know how I am known in heaven, let me say thank you, Lord, for the life of Prophet T.B. Joshua. Thank you, Lord, for bringing him for the rescue of nations. T.B. Joshua says, it is not how long you live, but how well you live the short life. It is not how long you live, but how well you live. It's not how long you live. Now, whether we like it or not, at one time, each one of us, the life we have will end.